Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I finally got my hands on this half wig Annie by Outre. I've been wanting this wig for so long and I finally got it. I'm so happy. Everything that people say about it in the reviews are 100% true. It's beautiful. It's full. I love the kinky straight texture. It's pretty long. I'm about 5'6". And this is how long it comes down on me. Um, Shedding. I have experienced a bit of shedding, not much. I mean, when I brush it out, I'll look down and I'll see about three strands. I um, haven't been experiencing tangling. It's extremely soft. I love when, it, when the wig is extremely soft. Oh my gosh, like, who wants a rough wig? Ew. Anyway, this wig is in the color one. Um, I would have rather had a two or at least a one B, but I got it at the beauty supply store and all they had was a one. So in order to blend my edges in, I used this brush in color by Kiss. If you don't have this brush in color, um, an alternative and probably something better is to just use an old mascara that you don't really like for your eyelashes or if you just don't use it anymore all mascara works just as well the only kind to using these brushing colors or mascara is that um if you don't let it dry all the way and you touch your hair you're going to get some black residue on your fingers and that's not cute but um yeah so if you just need a quick solution to get a darker hair color i um, recommend that if you have more time on your hands i recommend that you use just a rinse um so not a permanent hair color but this rinse um, called VIA Natural is the brand that I got at the beauty supply store. It lasts about six washes. And so that's that's pretty good. Um, I also have fine edges. And even when I wear um, like lace front wigs or lace part wigs, I'll use some black eyeshadow and a brush to just create like a darker um, shadow effect on my edges so that it doesn't look as wiggy going from this thick wig to fine edges because that looks kind of crazy so just to thicken up your edges a bit i definitely recommend using some eyeshadow so yeah that is it um i hope you guys like it i hope you guys like this wig on me if you haven't bought it yet if you've been thinking about it just go ahead and do it um like i said i got mine at a beauty supply store i wouldn't recommend doing that because it's way overpriced there so i will look on wig types and i'll leave a couple of links in the description bar where you can order yours and you could probably even get it in the right color um, so yeah, if you want a video of me actually demonstrating how I apply like the temporary color and the eyeshadow, just let me know in the comment box. And yes, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.